Joy of Time, helping you get the job you want. My name is Tusa Shlahadzi and I work at the GSA Travel Marketing Magazine. I uh, basically do administration, so that includes secretarial and receptionist work. So basically what I do is I do a lot of faxing. I take um, customer queries from the telephone and then I also do sourcing out um, leads for the sales team. And then I also fix out renewals for the advertising contracts and also make follow up on that. And then I also make sure that I take care of the database, make sure that everything is correct because it has to be in order all the times because we work on a deadline basis all the time. I really didn't choose this line of work, but as I said, as a graduate, hey, so I was looking for anything that was going to develop me into the work industry. So as I was looking for anything, this GSA happened to be the first opportunity. You know, so I just grabbed it with both hands, just for experience purposes. You know, but it was not my line of study. But well, I am enjoying it. I didn't really do a certain specific course to enjoy it, but you do need it in it a certain type of skills. Basically, you do you needed um, computer skills? You, your Excel had to be very good because you work mostly on Excel. But um, I had learned a lot of Excel at school, so I didn't really struggle that much. But you needed Excel, and you needed to pay a whole lot of attention to details. There is actually a whole lot of growth. Yeah, and first of all, what I like about the company, they don't really limit one, you know. You get to explore your talent in which way. You are first, when you step out in that door, you are first exposed to the sales and marketing of the company. And should you be interested, you are offered that opportunity, right. And then you can also get to write if you, if you know the skill and if you have the talent. You, know? you can also do photography within the industry and you can also get the chance to design advert. So there's actually a whole lot that you can do. You don't only the receptionist, you can actually grow in the company. I don't think there's any receptionist who's the who's there to stay as a receptionist, you know. And you also need to, um, to open doors for other people to come to the company, because it's difficult to come in the company and just start up there, you know. So most of the people, especially graduates, they start as a receptionist, you know, just to develop a little bit, you know, get to know the product, get to know the company, slowly but surely, and then you get there, yes. If you're looking for a job, like I'll, I'll speak from my side as a, if, if you just studied and you're looking for a job, okay. First of all, don't be choosy. Don't be specific. We know you studied, like I studied sport management. So I wasn't choosy, but I was, I was trying to apply for something that I think I would manage to do. So things like admin work were the first the things that I would apply for because I knew that admin work basically requires computer skills and I had done a little bit of computer skills at school. And then not forgetting that I done sport management, of course, so I'll apply also for things requiring sport wise and stuff. So, but the first thing that comes I would go for it, you know. You shouldn't tell yourself, ah, this is not what I want to do, you understand? Just open your mind, be open-minded. Open your mind, have confidence, go in there, start learning. It's about learning, learn new things. Don't be so narrow-minded, and this is what I want to do, and that's it, and that's all I know, you know. So I think you have to learn more about what other companies are all about, you know. And that's interesting as well as a person. It's more knowledge for you.